Hey everyone, it's me, Arthur Cade. Josephine, first of all, welcome back from Paris. Thank you. And second of all, how ridiculously gorgeous is this new flagship store we're in? Oh my God, I'm obsessed with this new store. The fact that we're even in the angel suite where you can go and get like private bridal showers coming and dressing you up, it's like, it's insane. Wait a minute, this is called the angel suite? Uh-huh, we are in the angel suite right now. I think my career is done. I'm in the <laughs> angel suite at the Victoria's Secret flagship store. Forget it, I'm retiring. Forget all the other stuff that I've left to do. I'm good to go. How is? <laughs> Have you been on the museum floor? They even yes. had like the old outfits. You can come take pictures with the wings and like get all up close. I was even so excited because I couldn't like remember half the outfit. How was Paris, by the way? Paris was so magical. It was like m the most enchanting trip we've ever been on. It was like kind of being in a movie 24-7. Well, it's going to be a TV yes. movie. It's <laughs> called the Victoria's Secret Fast Show. How ridiculous was the show? Walk me through the whole experience. Oh my God. Imagine just like being in the Grand Palais, first of all which is like one of the most iconic building, and then light it up completely in pink, and then have 51 of the most sexy women walking in stage in Andorra with some of the top performers like Bruno Morris, Lady Gaga, The Weeknd were all there. It was like the most sexy fashion show you can imagine. Just so fun. Monday, December 5th on CBS. Don't forget. <laughs> 10, 9 Central. When you look at that you've been able to become an angel and to experience this. I mean, like, I can feel your passion. Is it insane to you to, to think that this is your life? I still somehow expect some mornings to wake up and be like, okay, there was all like one really, really long dream. Um, no, it's just, I worked so hard for it and actually finding out that I became an angel and all that hard work paid out and you all of a sudden get the honor of wearing this Rolls outfit and opening with your wings, it was just, it's just such a dream come true. What's the first thing you do once the show is over? Like you're training, you're eating right. Like do you just go ballistic and go crazy and just eat like Shake Shack, <laughs> like four orders? Yes. <laughs> you don't. You do go a little crazy. But actually, the most exciting for me was taking my shoes off. Um, I was so excited to be in flat sweatpants and just sit and have pizza and dance on the table with the girls. I've seen some of the cool moments from the show. What were some of the cool moments that you saw and got to experience? Um, I had a really cool moment with Bruno Mars on stage. We were like dancing and I had my sparkly outfit, I was twirling. Then I happened to hit him with my outfit, but I hope I didn't hurt him too bad. <laughs> Kendall, Bella, Gigi, they all got their wings. How cool was that? Did they know what was going on? Were you guys able to kind of experience it with them? Yeah, it's so fun. Like even like when we do, when you meet girls who's doing the show for the first time or the second time, there's some side of really cool excitement because everybody has that first time jitters. And it was just really cool being able to like advise them and help them out. And like everybody's like watching the screen when we do the rehearsal, and you're like, do you like that pose? Or should I do that? And like it's one big sisterhood. We're all helping each other out just to make the best night possible. When you look at representing this brand and what this brand means to so many millions of people around the world, what does it mean to you to be able to represent it? It's been such an honor to be chosen to be part of this family, being included in such an elite and just being a face of a company that stands for everything I love, it's just amazing. We're, I was walking through the store and I'm like, oh my God, if I had a girlfriend, I would buy like half of this store. So. Oh my God, the new collection I'm like to die for. I've like told my whole family, this is all you guys are gonna get because I wanna see everybody in it. Like I love the metallic lace and the new Wicked bra is like my favorite. It looks, honestly, it's like kind of like the traveling pants. When we shot it for the holiday commercial, everybody's boobs looked awesome. That doesn't always happen because you know, things fit different on people, but this one, fits on everybody. Being an angel, how has it changed your life? I mean, do you walk down the streets and people are like, oh my God, that's one of the angels right there. Like, have you had some really crazy moments around that? Yeah, I've had people sleep outside my hotel waiting for me to come out, no like stop way. reading. But it's it's really, really sweet. Like the, the fans that the Victoria's Secret has created and that they have is so warming and they're just so loyal. And it's, it's really cool to experience that. I'm so grateful for all my fans. What are your holiday plans? We're coming up on the holidays. What are you gonna be doing? I'm gonna go back to my mom's place. I'm gonna sleep on the couch and she's gonna spoil me.